Ladies and gentlemen, so today I would like to share about the air pollution index of Malaysia. As you know, um, uh, this week and also next week is the movement control order taking place that restrict the movement of the people uh, to go to the office and so on. So if you can see here, um, the quality of the air, uh, theoretically based on the regional hazards, haze situation indicate that the uh, majority of the places uh, recorded good and moderate uh, levels. Eh? Unfortunately, I cannot see the the data uh, based on the previous date, which is uh, one week before or a few weeks before. Uh, if you want to do so, you may want to request uh, personally with the uh, Department of Environment and maybe they, they need some fees or if you are government uh, official, uh, perhaps they can uh, just share the data with you. So, um, one of the things that I, I would like to emphasize here is actually COVID-19 crisis. Uh, the movement of the car is already being restricted and therefore the pollution of the air and also uh, the issues regarding um, the air pollution can be controlled. So, it's a good mechanism um, indirectly to control the uh, air pollution issue in our country. Okay, so that is one of the benefit uh, beside uh, the other things of the uh, COVID-19. Um, perhaps uh, also I would like to share with you um, some of the other things that may influence the COVID-19 um, just to stay indoors. It's actually, it reduced significantly the um, crime index in Malaysia around 50 to 70 percent has been reported by a lot of uh, reporters here and also by PDRM. So beside the air pollution, uh, the crime rates also um, possibly reduce due to the uh, fact that a lot of people are uh, waiting or just staying indoors inside their house. So, um, can influence the COVID-19 pandemic is actually the number of birth rate. Okay, reported by uh, NST, by uh, Ministry of um, uh, Women Affairs um, and Family, Malaysia will be expected to have more babies in January or February to, uh, 2021. This is due to the fact that a lot of people are staying indoors and uh, they will also influence the influx uh, of the baby birth rate. Uh, for the upcoming years. So um, it is a very good uh, positive impact on the other sides of the uh, COVID-19 crisis. Okay, uh, I already explained to you about these three uh, significant or three ideas that may give you a positive impact um, about the COVID-19. So the first one is the uh, reductions of pollution, especially on air pollution. Uh, and also with regard to the other kind of pollution, river pollution and so on. And then uh, we can also see the reductions of crime rate um, due to the fact that a lot of people stay indoors. And the last but not least is the increasing of the birth rate that expectedly uh, will be happening in the next few years. This is because of a lot of people stay indoors and uh, most of the time they, they spend together with the family, husband and wife and so on. So I hope that you find this video enjoy and remember please stay.